Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping from my hometown track pen national race course in Granville, Pennsylvania. It is Friday evening, July the 31st, and this is my day at the track.com race of the day. I'm going to focus on race three this evening, folks, 7.34 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a five furlong sprint on the turf track. Phillies and mares, three years old and up, racing for a stakes purse of $100,000. Contenders number nine, smart and fancy. Number seven, uh, he's destiny. Number three, instrumentalist. And number eight, an officer and a lady. Number nine, smart and fancy, has hit the board in power run fashion each of her last five outings, winning in both her second and fifth races back. Jockey Jeremy Rose has been in her honors on five previous occasions and never missed the board, winning en route to a positive 88% return on investment in the process, and he's here in Grantville for tonight for his sixth ride, gunning for another the circle trip. Number seven, Abvi's Destiny, a four to one shot, has hit the board in power run fashion in both of her last two, winning in her second race back. Race three summary, number nine, Smart and Fancy tops my contenders list, which also includes number seven, Abvi's Destiny, number three, Instrumentalist, and number eight, An Officer and a Lady, nine, seven, three, eight, in the third today from Penn National. Got a couple of bonus long shots for you as usual, folks. Let's go to Finger Lakes first, race five, the 20 to 1 bomb, number seven, Folio, the overall speed leader in this climbing field, racing at a mile and 70 yards on the dirt. And the race tonight at Charlestown, race seven, check out the 10 to 1 bomb, number seven, Disco Indy, takes a class drop of seven track master units at decent speed for this seven furlong sprint. So from Penn National on a Friday night, we've got a $100,000 stake race here this evening, folks. A $200,000 stake race on Saturday. Rick Needham reminding you, as always, to please bet with your head, not over.